Good afternoon. Well, I don't know when you're watching this. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever you're watching this. Thank you so much for tuning in to today's exciting, exciting episode. I am in South Dakota. The wind is blowing and I'm fishing a new lake. It's like five o'clock. I think actually I think it's like six o'clock, like 6 p.m. So we're going to go after some top water bite and, uh, and we're going to see how things pan out. We're at a lake with some big fish, big northerns, big largemouth and big small mouth bass. There's one, there's one. That's a good one. Good one. Yep, that's a good one. Oh my God, he popped off. That was a big one, dude. That was a big one. <sighs> how that? How did that happen? Get a little shit here. Top water on that reef since it's so shallow. It could, yeah. It could be insane. It could, yeah, if they're pulled up on there. That was sick when it hit my... First cast, dude. First cast. That's a good one too, that's a good one. First cast, and we might have just figured something out, boys. Tried a new bait. Dude, that's a good one. Yeah, 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 we gotta get in that for sure. Dude, it's a big one. These fish are so strong. There you go. Well, folks, we've been here for quite a few, I don't know, maybe like an hour and a half or so. First smallmouth, whoa, let's get some good lighting. First smallmouth, gorgeous. God, look how just pretty these fish are. I can't get over it. I love coming up north and catching these guys. That's what we came here for. Not quite the size I wanted, but it's not bad. See, buddy. Back in the water she goes. All right. You got one? Yep. Piggin? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hang on. Oh, I've, I'm hooked up too, bro. Dude, I got I got one too. We're doubled. I was going to I was going to reach out and grab the net. Are you okay? Can you manage? All right, I've got one. <laughs> Lost it. It's okay. We saw it. It counts. I got one too. Yeah, buddy. Oh, I think we uh. You got one, dude. We almost had a triple, bro. Oh, get this fish up in here. Let's catch another one. Oh man, Matt just had a big one. That was a big one, wasn't it? Yeah. And it and it flopped off. I just caught one. Just a little guy. And we're gonna see what Christian pulls up here. There you go. Hold him up next to mine. Got doubles, baby. I love it. All right, see, buddy. We're gonna catch another one. That should have been triple. That really should have been. Those were all decent. Matt had a big one, though. That was crazy. All right, see, that's that's how small smallmouth fishing goes, boys. You just gotta you just gotta fish until you find the school. We're on them. We found them. Drop the poles. Oh shit, we don't have poles. Oh, Matt's hooked up. Big one. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. All right, I'll come back and help you. Watch don't don't lose this one. That's a good one, dude. That's a. Oh, dude, look at all of them with them. Look at all of them with them. Bring yours in. Bring yours in. Bring yours in. Dude, there's. Leave it in the water. 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 Let it swim around. Let it swim around. It's underneath the let it let it swim around, dude. There was three of them with them. They're schooled up. Right They're schooled right. up hard. Just let them swim around. Let them swim around. See if we can catch one. Should I bring him up? Again? Got him. Got him. Oh no, he came off. Get him. Come on, drop him down. Drop him down. Drop him down. I just had one. Got him, got him, I got him, I got him, I got him, we got jumps, we got triples, we got triples, oh my god, what the hell's going on? Alright, get to the front. Alright, we each everybody's got a... No, you lost yours! Alright, Matt, Matt, Matt took one for the team. Oh my god. What the hell? That's so dumb. Come on, come on, yes! Yes, dude! I feel bad, dude. I made you lose that fish by leaving it in the water. I feel so bad, Matt. Look at this one. Freaking tiger shark. That thing was big too. Dude, you guys have no idea. You guys are probably like, first off, your eardrums are probably exploded because I was yelling. Matt brought one in and there were three of them with it. Christian and I dropped down on them and caught two. Look at that, bro. Absolutely. This is why smallmouth fishing is so much freaking fun. All right, I'm going to release, release this pretty girl right here. See you, buddy. Hell yeah, dude. That was the sickest smallmouth moment I've ever had in my entire life. Again, I feel so bad for Matt because he had like an 18 inch smallie and I made him leave it in the water so we could catch him and then his popped off, but that's all right. Took one for the team. I'll do that next time I do, next time I hook one, I'll leave it in the water too, but that was insane. Hands down, the craziest smallmouth moment I've ever had in my entire life. Absolutely crazy. If you guys enjoyed that, leave a like right now. We're gonna try to do it again. 
Hopefully Matt can actually land his. He's he's over two, and those were two big ones too. It's his first time. He got his first smallmouth today, or yeah, yesterday. So it's his first time. Okay, but this right. was uh, it's exciting stuff. We're uh, we're finally catching fish. It took about an hour and a half to find the school, and now we are on what I call the sauce. There's one. Yep. All right, everybody cast. Rom, everybody, everybody cast. <laughs> Christian, you got to cast in there. I'm gonna let him swim around for a minute, all right? That's a good one, that's a good one. I'm hooked up, boys. I'm gonna let my, I'm gonna, oh, he came off! No! That was, that was bigger than the other one. Son of a, ah! Well, boys, what'd you think of that? That was amazing. Was, was it fun? That was probably one of the best 30 minutes of my life. One of the best 30 minutes of his life, he says. Crazy. And he fished a lot. And he fished a lot. That was no that was just incredible moment. Uh, we kept fishing, didn't hook anymore. We're gonna we've got 30 minutes left. It's 9 p.m. 30 minutes left. I'm gonna throw a buzz bait. Chris, er, uh, Christian's gonna throw a buzz bait. Matt's gonna throw a popper. And we're just gonna go for whatever bites. Largemouth, northern pike, smallmouth, doesn't matter. We're gonna try to end the evening on some. I don't know what I was gonna say there. Six and a half hours later. Good morning, everybody. It is. 4.06 a.m. We got up early this morning. We're gonna try for some top water. We didn't get any top water bites last night. We couldn't really find them. I'm not sure what the deal is. I'm gonna go where there's some like, I don't wanna walk into Casey to the camera. It's just a little, just a little odd. We didn't catch anything um, last night. So we're gonna go this morning and try to catch some top water fish. That's kind of the plan right now. We got up super early. We gotta put a little bit of gas in the boat. And we're gonna throw some frogs, some poppers, some buzz baits. That's pretty much about it. That's that's mainly the goal for this morning. This top water, top water, top water. I have not caught a smallmouth on top water. I don't think so yet this trip, which is a big, big goal of mine. I love top water. You guys know that. So we got up early, and we are gonna see if we can make some magic happen. Woo! We made it. We were gonna go do some uh, rock like a rock uh, reef, top water, a little too windy for that. So I think we're gonna try to tuck up away from the wind a little bit in the reeds and around docks and stuff like that. We know we know of a few places on this lake where we can we can try to get away from the wind. Like I said, goal today, top water bass. Large mouth, small mouth, and pike. Yeah, so we, as much as I wanna stay, those docks are guaranteed. There he is, there he is, there he is. Yep, got him, got him. That's a big small mouth. Grab that net, grab that net. Swoop him up, baby. Oh my gosh, there we go. There we go. All right, let's drop him down. Thank you. Well, as soon as I was saying I want to leave, because we weren't catching any, I was thinking about going over to the docks. Smoked the first topwater smallie of the day. Look at that, gorgeous, dude. Absolutely gorgeous. That's what we came here for. Top water, quality smallmouth like that guy right there. Catch and release always, baby. Whoop. Hell yeah. I'll show you guys what bait I was throwing here. Just this little guy right here, little sexy shad colored, if you guys can see that, little sexy shad colored top water spook with a feather, feather hook on the back. Just slowly walking it. We were just about to try to make a move because we had not had any blown up blow ups yet and there's some docks and some reeds and stuff but I think we'll stay for another minute here oh, is. oh cast in there cast in there cast in there oh got him there you go you got him there you go there's a bunch back there I know I'm, I'm gonna get ready I'm gonna get ready a yeah that is a large man there you go, Christian caught Christian caught my fish that I missed. That's your first top water. I think that was the that might have been the one that hit mine. I don't know, but I I had a hit. I missed it. As I was reeling mine in, I was telling Christian to go throw in there. He threw in there, hit his, missed it, kept reeling and hit it again. <laughs> Freaking fish are incredibly aggressive. Right now we're fishing these reeds, bulrushes. I don't know what they're called. The little little sticky things. And Christian just caught another one. I saw that one. Look at that. Just we went all morning without catching any. That's a better one. That's a solid two. There we go. The buzz bait, man. 
the old buzz. Not much, but you can't hardly beat a buzz bait. There he is, there he is. There we go, finally, buzz bait fish. That's a good fish. I don't need the I'm gooch. That's a good largemouth, baby. That's what we're after. Yes, sir. We've been throwing buzz baits the last, I don't know, quarter mile stretch with no, not much luck. That dude just absolutely cranked it, right? There's a dock, you can see a dock here, and there's reeds and rocks, and it was kind of right in between all of that. A little transition point right where that guy was. Awesome. See you later, little guy. Well, folks, my goal was to catch topwater fish, and I have, in fact, accomplished that. Caught a large mouth on a buzz bait, caught a small mouth on a spook. There's one, there's one. Large mouth. Right out of those reeds, dude, they're still tucked in there. Yes, sir. Right in those reeds. Another, another pretty little large mouth. Right out of those reeds. We're, uh, Right, literally between the dock and the reeds, just like that last one. I think I might have kind of kind of figured out a little pattern. If you can find reeds with with rocks mixed in next to a dock, and you bring this little black little squeaky buzz bait next to it, and you're gonna catch catch yourself a little LMB. <laughs> oh, there's one. There's one. It's a better one, I think. Yes, sir. Another booze bait. Pike. Pike! My first pike of the year! Oh my gosh. My first pike of the year. I gotta hold him. I gotta touch him. I'll grab him. I got him. I got him. Look at that little slimy snake. That's my first pike of the year. Crazy. I used to catch these things all the time in the lake back home. Uh, they all died off or I just suck at fishing. Probably, probably I just suck at fishing, but see you later, little guy. Back in the water. Boom! Woo! Finally caught a pike. On top water, too. It don't get much better than that, boss. 12 o'clock midnight. Well, folks, we are now back at the old hotel room. Just chilling here, kind of doing a little bit of unwinding. I wanted to end the video here. I didn't do a, a, an outro out on the water. We just fished, basically fished top water, and then we came back here and we took a nap. And we actually went out tonight we got a whole bunch of big fish, so look forward to that video. But I didn't do an outro for the video that you guys are watching now, so that's why I'm doing it like right now. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a thumbs up. Would really appreciate it if this video got a lot of likes. Make sure you subscribe if you already haven't. Drop a comment down below. Where do you want me to go next? Maybe what species do you want me to target next? Uh, I went after some smallmouth today, and we actually ended up catching some pretty, pretty solid smallmouth. It's pretty epic. The old, uh, the old triple up. Even though I feel bad, bad for this guy, he did. He did sacrifice his fish for for me and Christian, but that's just how it goes. I, I sacrificed one for Christian too, so it was a, it was all, it was all good. It was all fun stuff. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a fun time making it. Tomorrow morning is the last morning here, and then we are headed home back to largemouth fishing. So if you guys are getting tired of the smallmouth fishing, don't worry, it's ending soon. If you guys do like the smallmouth fishing, let me know, and I'll come back up here, or maybe go to Canada, Minnesota, Wisconsin. I don't know wherever else the smallmouth. Go somewhere different next time. Thank you so much for watching and peace.